Hey guys, so I'm heading over to meet Janine and her husband for dinner at the Bolden Creek Cafe, recommended by Mrs. Plant. <laughs> Thanks, Amy, for the recommendation. So I'm just walking down <laughs> this alleyway, and this place is really unique. It has a re lot of really cool houses, and has a Portland vibe. Totally has a Portland vibe about it. All the houses are very unique and interesting. I saw one that looked kind of like, it had like a winding staircase on the outside that went to like this little room on the roof. I don't want to like film people's homes too much, but I'll show you the alleyway that I'm walking down. It's really pretty here. I'm using Google Maps to find my way. <laughs> it's a 10 minute walk from where I'm staying, I guess. They don't have Uber and Lyft here. So there's another thing called rideshare that I might do on my way home since it's gonna be dark out when I come home. But I figured since it's still light out right now, I'll walk there and then I just won't walk back in the dark. <laughs> How are you? I know what you say that this guy is granny. Yeah. Well, you are always granny, right? <laughs> Not always. So I had a really nice time with Janine and Scott from Banana Wisdom and that was a really good cafe. It did kind of upset my stomach but that's my own fault. I should have ate something healthier. Tomorrow I'll do better. <laughs> so anyway, it was really good though. So if you guys have never tried the Bolden Creek Cafe in Austin, Texas and if you ever get the chance to try it, they had a lot of vegan friendly options on the menu and a lot of stuff sounded really good. It took us like 10 minutes to decide. <laughs> what we all wanted from the menu. I made a bad choice. I should have picked something healthier, but you live and you learn. What can I say? So uh, Janine and Scott left to go do some grocery shopping so that they have some breakfast items tomorrow. I have oatmeal here with me and that's what I'm gonna have. So I just stayed in since my tummy's bothering me. And so that's it for today. Thanks for watching my little broccoli bites and I'll catch you in the next video.